Where do I think this takes place in the Dragon Ball Super timeline? I once again, I'm I don't know. I've not watched Dragon Ball Super. I've only seen I've seen a couple clips and I've seen like one to two episodes and those were the very first episodes of Dragon Ball Super. So, I I have no idea. As far as I'm concerned, this is like its own thing. Like there's Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GT, Dragon Ball Super, and then Dragon Ball Fighters. That's how that's how I view this. That's how I see this right now. Alright, so we're on chapter two, map two. This is a map of the Dragon Ball world. Take control of the character you've linked with and bring it into the chaos that's grippling the land. Moving to a new space on the map uses up one of your allotted turns. If you run out of turns, it's game over, so plan each of your moves wisely. This is a boss icon. Defeat this uh, space's boss to advance the story. Make sure you defeat the boss characters before you run out of remaining turns. Chapter two, map two, start. So you have you have ten turns. You have after you can go straight to the boss. It looks like. Well, you can choose to level up your characters and choose your path. Let's go to map menu, see what that does. Sound and language button settings, edit team. I don't have anybody to select as far as team goes. Oh, let's select Goku. Player skills, I don't have any. Uh, link events, no link events available, view stats. Uh, special move list, okay. So I need this. Meteor Smash, Warp Kamea, Formable and Ears, Kamea, Flurry Kick, Dragon Fizz. Alrighty. And then uh, show map help. Rescue event. Defeat an enemy on the space to rescue a character. Defeat a boss on the space to advance to the next arc. And that's the battle tutorial, if I see that one. Boo battle, fight with Boo to earn more experience than normal battles. Battle, fight an enemy, okay. So Boo, Boo's just kind of like a, uh, kind of like grind mode. All right, so we got 10 turns to do this shit. Let's, let's just go, let's start off this way. Let's go this way. Yeah. I guess there's nothing there, so there's no reason to uh, move on to an enemy space to start a battle with them. Battle grants EXP, which powers you up, increases your link level. Your link level determines the abilities of your link allies. Higher link levels let Goku and his friend unleash more power, so keep fighting and get stronger. Cool, cool. So yeah, so if they're empty, completely empty, there's like literally nothing there, and if there's something on there, it can be between tutorials and battles for EXP. Nice. All right, so let's uh, let's do this boss battle. Tutorial battle. Uh, perform some simple attacks. Fire a barrage of key blasts at your opponent from across the stage. You move in close with a super dash and finish them off with a super combo. Hmm, I ought to be in this area somewhere. Ah! is just as I thought he would be I thought I sensed a power similar to mine it looks like I was right hello me <laughs> what do you think looks just like me huh even has my hair I don't really know what's going on myself but I think this is what they call a clone I 
hear there's a bunch more of these clone guys causing trouble all over the place. That's not good. <laughs> Out of all the people, they chose to bring Nappa back. <laughs> and it's not just their looks that are the same. They use the same moves as the not clones, too. This is the first time I've ever gone up against one myself. Feels kind of weird. You know what I mean? Hmm. Guess I won't know if I can beat him until I fight him. Actually, I just had a thought. This might be some good training for me, since he uses all the same moves and everything. At any rate, let's take care of this guy. What do you say? Sound fun? It does to me. It's time to face your opponent! All right, clone Goku. Let's see what you got. Actually, it's it's a tutorial, so I, I don't expect anything. Let's give it a go. That's how it's done. One more time. Follow me, surprise. One more time. Uh, buddy. Try this one next. You really blew me away there. You come this far, so I'm sure you'll be fine. Good job. The red and gray color scheme reminds you of uh, Evil Goku from AF. Welcome they should have brought back right to said Nappa. Guy with Goku's face surprised you. I don't know. <laughs> Between the two of them, I don't know. Did I like the great Saiyan man as a character? I thought he was a great comic relief. I wish it didn't have to be Gohan. Or if it had to be Gohan, then he would have somehow kept up his training while doing all that. There are loads of those clones all over the place now. Who knows when another one will attack? You better stay alert. You hear me, soul inside Goku? Before I forget, there's some good news for the both of you. I managed to analyze those mysterious waves and mod this plane to neutralize them. If everything goes according to plan, we should be able to free Goku's consciousness. In other words, the old Goku should be back soon. Well, we've got nothing to lose. Ha! Back in the outside world! Awesome! All right, It worked! Wait, something's not right. My body, it feels... It feels all heavy and weak. I knew it. I'm as weak as a kitten. I won't be fighting like this, that's for sure. Man... The wave neutralizer still has some kinks. I guess it'll be a while until we can restore your strength. Or maybe we could skip all that and use the Dragon Balls to fix this whole mess. You can do that, right, Bulma? You can do anything! No can do. The Dragon Balls are stone, remember? They might as well be bowling balls. Oh, right. I totally forgot about that. Uh, you forgot, huh? I guess you really are, Goku. Anyway, soul inside Goku. Were you listening? 
I trust you got all that. Until we can restore the real Goku's power, we're going to need you on battle duty. Okay, time for us to go find 16 and save our friends! Hey, I feel something. It's faint, but is that someone's power? Yeah, it is. I'm sure of it. Krillin! Come on! We gotta save him! So help me jog my memory and especially let me know if it has something to do with Super. But they were talking about how like the Dragon Balls are stone. And the only like the most re like I said, I haven't watched Super. And the most recent time I remember Dragon Balls going stone is when uh is in uh GT <laughs> after the whole uh sh the Omega Shinron type deal. Actually that wouldn't that, that wasn't even the Dragon Balls going stone. That was just the Shadow Dragon Balls. Well they had like a year to find the Dragon Balls again after using them. And the only time the other the Dragon Balls inside of the Universe 7 went stone is when they used the, the ones on Planet Namek. But did they but then they came back after uh after New Namek was made and after Dende became a thing. That must be a super thing. So this must be in Super. How are you guys talking about? I have no idea. I have no idea. I guess I, I guess I do need to catch up on Super. The only thing was holding me back is the Japanese dubs and the animation. But I guess that's that's on me. So, all right. So we got some stuff here. Krillin looks like a boss and tutorial mechanic. Let's start off with Yamcha. And it does look like we can, yeah. So we can go like uh, do. We can start off with Yamcha and then hit up this, this, this. Go here. Well, I mean, there's no point in going here, but you can go here and then do the thing. All right, y'all, give me a quick second. We're gonna, uh, you know, we'll start this. All right, about tutorial battle. Use dashes, back steps, Z combos to take down your opponent, master these techniques, and nothing can stand in your way. Yeah, we'll do that. Give me a second, I'll be right back. Alright. Let's continue this story mode. It's if Kami of Earth dies, they turn to stone. You know what? That's right. That's how they wished everybody back. Um, <laughs> it's been a while since I watched DBZ. That's how they wished everybody back in the Boo Saga. They used the new Namix, uh Dragon Balls because they had three wishes to uh, to do that. Okay, that ma it makes sense now. So this is this is after the Z story. But because Beardus and them is in here, it's somewhere in between Super. But I just, I personally don't know where it is in between Super. So okay, makes sense. We're, we're good. We're all caught up. I just had a brain fart for a second. Yamcha, for real? Damn. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Yo, I understand that this game is really good at making all the characters look good, but I do not understand everybody's obsession with quote unquote Lord Yamcha lately. I don't I don't get that. That's just me. Ganny, I'm, I'm going to ask that you uh, keep keep the chat spoiler free. I have not seen this. I haven't seen anything about the game. I, like, I've seen some stuff, but I do want to be surprised. So, like, anything that they do or don't explain, uh, just try to hold that off until I get to that point in the story. Uh, we go here. I tried to go back, but sure. We'll go. This place is too far away, so you actually have to, uh. You have to click in between spaces. Okay. Ward, attack power uh, tutorial. No, that's one thing that they I, I did say that in the very beginning but that's one thing that they did well with this game is making it not only easily accessible but making it still making it challenging and uh, kind of like freeform when it comes to doing your combos for people who are experienced at these types of fighting games Uh, let, me, let me switch that out real quick. I was about to say, let me switch that out real quick. Uh, yeah, I care about story in a fighting game. Otherwise, I wouldn't be playing a goddamn story. <laughs> Why, why would I why would I be playing the story if I did not give a shit about the story? Otherwise, I'd skip over it completely and do everything else. <laughs> uh, hold on. No, don't do that. That, 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 that. That literally defeats the purpose of me sitting here like watching everything and doing shit. I want to get. I wonder. I wasn't bullshit when I said I'm a diehard DBZ fan. I want to watch this shit. I want to taste it. I want to drink it. I want to make sure I'm getting my goddamn sixty dollars worth. Oh, so this is not a tattoo. This is a straight up battle. KO bonus. Health recovery bonus level 3. It's time to face your opponent. Yeah, Super Saiyan 4, uh, Goku and Vegeta would look cool in this game. I hope at some point, even if it's DLC, that they throw them in. And if they look cool, I wouldn't mind getting them. Get ready. Huh. 
Okay. Okay, so no Dragon Balls in the story. At least yet. Apparently, I didn't block that. Uh, apparently, I need fucking refresher. I, I need a fucking refresher. Holy shit. Even after the damn beta, I need a goddamn refresher. You're not a diehard DBZ fan if you're sitting there saying, uh, nigga, please, to a story in a DBZ game. Somebody who's a diehard DBZ like fan is going to check the shit out, whether regardless if the story sucks or not. <laughs> like that, that makes absolutely no sense. Xenoverse, in my opinion, Xenoverse, Xenoverse Two. And Battle of Z was ass. Uh, what, what was that other game? Ultimate Tenkaichi? But because I'm a Dragon Ball Z fan, I still checked the shit out for the story just to see what it was like and see if it was entertaining to me, regardless of how I felt about it afterwards. Like, if that's how you feel, that's how you feel. But that's one of the main fucking reasons I'm playing the story is to check out the goddamn story. If I really didn't give a shit, I, I would not play it all. There's plenty of other streamers and shit like that who are playing this shit that have expressed their disdain for uh, the overdrawn and long out story. I know this shit's like nine hours long, but that I, that's what I'm here for. You really blew me away there. Keep trying. Good job! Keep trying! You, you gonna attack? <laughs> Ten! <laughs> Bruh! <laughs> I, I see walkthrough of this game, so don't get on my level. You obviously feeling yourself tonight, bruh. So if that's how you feel, then go... That, nigga, watch somebody else. It's not that damn serious. <laughs> it, is, it is not that damn serious. If that's how you feel, then please do, do everybody a favor and just go somewhere else. It's that simple. I came for this shit. I, can't, I told y'all I came for this shit to... Every game I play, I play to make sure I'm getting my full money worth. 
whether they be checking out the story or not. And especially in a game where I feel like it's good, hell yeah, I'm expecting a story out of a DBZ game, especially considering that's one of the main things they're marketing about this goddamn game. So, Brett, you, you're not hurting my feelings or anybody else. If you would like to go do yourself a favor and save yourself the trouble and go watch somebody else, that is perfectly fine with me. Especially when you, uh... <laughs> Bruh, come on. Charger Kid, my more tutorials. How many got Nigga? Yo, Jack, what's happening? Y'all already know what it is. We in here for the uh, Dragon it's Ball gone. Fighters game. It. Is that a clone? No, it's going after Krillin. I've got to save him. The outcome of this fight is anybody's guess. That's right, I gotta remember that shit. That's one of the main things I gotta remember is everybody has a fucking Kamehameha wave. You really blew me away there. Or not everybody has a Kamehameha wave, but everybody has at least like a, a fireball motion of some kind. Krillin is now playable. Of course that's the first goddamn character y'all give us. Shade be throwing left be thrown left and right. Yeah, that's what that's what I've been hearing. That's what people been telling telling me. That's what Nova told me. That's what I've been seeing on a thumbnail. So we're about to find out. I'm pretty sure one of the ones who get roasted the most is Gohan, so. You finally come around. I thought you were a goner. Uh, say, where are we? Is this Bulma's airplane? The last thing I remember is investigating the origin of the clones. And then I got all dizzy. Let's see. Nah, it's no good. I can't recall anything after that. So did you save me, Goku? <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Goku. You never let me down. No need to thank me. It's nothing. After all, whenever I'm in a pinch, who's the guy who's always there to throw me a sensu bean? <laughs> well, that's the first one. Because <laughs> that's all Krillin's been good for, is throwing them goddamn beans. <laughs> well, sometimes I think I'd rather be the one eating them, though. <laughs> so, who did this to me? I can't remember a thing. A lot's gone on, Krillin. And not much of it good. Now, where to begin? 